Libya, former Italian colony, becomes an independent state, and the Emir Idris el Senussi is crowned its king, acclaimed by crowds of loyal subjects. January 1952, and King Idris takes the Libyan throne, a close friend of the West. But the monarchy did not last. Colonel Gaddafi led the 1969 coup, and those loyal subjects quickly changed sides. In London, I've been talking to King Idris's exiled successor, Mohammed, who calls himself the Crown Prince. Is he now in touch with the leaders of the movement to oust the Gaddafi regime? I think everybody, they, they lead the, the, you know, the, the revolution. Uh, there is no particular people. The whole, uh, the whole Libyan people, they lead this revolution, especially young people. So but obviously some people are more important than others, for example, generals who might have changed sides? Are you trying to contact the powerful people? What I try to do now to stop the mass massacre, uh, I try to uh, uh, put pressure and uh, call the international community to stop uh, this killing. Gaddafi, he must leave. And that's what I try to do every day. So what should the international community do and what can the international community do? The international community, they, they know the way to, uh, to stop the massacre. But are, are you in favor of military intervention from the international community? I think anything stop killing, I will uh, support it. Are you planning to return to Libya? Are you, are you thinking of going home now? It's not the issue now going home. Uh, of course, my heart is with my people there, but the main issue now is uh, the massacre. This is the main issue. Th this is an anti-Qaddafi revolution, I if you like. It's, it's not a pro-monarchy, not a pro-restoration of the monarchy movement, is it? Of course, yeah. People came in the street, you know, by themselves after 40 years, and they asked for freedom. They asked to live as a human. That's what they ask. Do you think the restoration of the monarchy in Libya would be a good idea? This is up to Libyan people, but again, there is a human disaster and uh, people dying, and this is what uh, make me move now and use all my contact to stop, th to stop this blood. Sir, thank you very much thank for you. talking to Al Jazeera English. Thank, thank you. you. Sir. Thank you.